Nature awes us, nature inspires us, and nature humbles us. As we stand here among these trees, which have stood for centuries, as we take in the ravine this river has carved, as we hear the sound of water which sustains us, and feel the sturdy ground which supports us, let us be reminded that, like nature, love is powerful. Let all of our hearts be filled with gratitude as we honor our purpose here today to join you, Rob and Ellen, in marriage. So Rob and I met uh, when we were both going to St. Mary's. We were in the MBA together and we had a class together, it was economics. Well, I think the first thing that drew me to Ellen was that uh, it was a three hour course and halfway through the lecture, she would go out and fill up her teapot with tea. And so the rest of us were there sort of struggling away, working away. And she would just come through with this teapot, carrying it along with a little tea cozy on it and come and sit back down next to us. It was like a three hour a night class and I would really need tea to get through the, the class and I had a kettle in my office so in, at like the halfway point in class I would go and boil some more water and then I would bring uh, a teapot in and to keep my tea warm I, the teapot has a tea cozy and uh, Rob always remembers me walking in to class and class had already been like started, so I just walked in the middle of this lecture carrying a teapot with this tea cozy on it and uh, you know, in like a wool sweater I think I was that day and I think he thinks about that moment quite fondly. <laughs> Today means a lot to me. It's really great to be doing this. It's something I never really thought I would do necessarily for a lot of my life and then I met Ellen and knew right away that sort of my whole life was just sort of turned around based on that. It means a lot because like Rob is just the most like amazing person and when I met him like I knew right away that like there's nobody else in my life that I've ever met who's like him who just gets me. When he looks at me, he really sees me. And to be able to just like go to this like really secluded and sacred spot with him and just like look into his eyes and know that like he's seeing like all that I am. I don't know how I got so lucky that like the kindest man in the world like thinks that I deserve such great love, so. <laughs> Marriage is a union of two souls, a commitment taken with great consideration and respect for one another and oneself. The choice you have made to undertake marriage reflects the miracle that you somehow stumbled upon one another and recognize something true and familiar in the heart of the other. Everything is just as it should be. Your love story began in the woods. On one of your first dates together, you stood in a forest not far from here on a cold, clear day in December and watched as a tree let go its hold on the earth and crashed down a ravine, much like this one, into the river below. It was sudden and startling, and it was a special moment because you stood together, sharing the experience and the memory of this mundane yet spectacular occurrence, a tree falling in the forest, something so ordinary that day was something remarkable because you stood side by side and bore witness to it together. Rob, you may now speak your vows to Ellen. Ellen Catherine Schaffner, 
past four years with you have been the best four years of my life. Ever since our first walk in the woods, I've known that you are someone special that I'd want to spend the rest of my life with. You've shown me a love deeper and more unconditional than I knew could exist. No matter what life has in store for us, we will always be able to face it together. I want us to spend the rest of our lives together and cherish all the memories that we can look back and what we'll have shared together as one. Well. I promise to return the love that you have given me unconditionally and forever. Alan Catherine Schaffner, I am forever happy that life has brought us together. I look forward to all the beautiful moments that we will share, and I cannot wait to begin writing the first chapter of our book as man and wife. Thank you. Rob. <laughs> you are the most kind, loving, and genuine person I have ever met. From the moment I saw you in that economics class, <laughs> you took my breath away and made me believe that everything I had been doing in my life had a purpose to bring me to you. Every day I wake up and still can't believe that I'm so lucky to have you and that we are lucky enough to be here in this life together. Robert James Haldane, I promise that I will keep putting you first all the days of our life. I promise that I will keep working every day for our love and I promise to keep trying every day to be the woman and wife you deserve, loving you with complete devotion now and forever. I pledge these things to you with joy in my heart that I get to take my place today as your wife and partner for now and for always. Robin Ellen, may you always find strength, laughter, comfort, and happiness in each other's keeping. May you always find peace and contentment in these forests where you may be so easily reminded of all that is great and inexplicable in this universe. By virtue, virtue of the authority vested in me by the Marriage Act, I hereby pronounce you, Robert James Haldane, and Ellen Catherine Schaffner to be husband and wife. You may share the case. Mm -hmm.